Well, if you're looking for the best knot to join braid to mono, this is it, it's called an FG, and it's all based on the principle of the Chinese finger trap. It literally locks around the mono. There's no knot at all at the end of the day. So, like this, I grab my braid, and I wrap it around my thumb a few times to lock that off. Then around my index finger, lock that off. And then I grab it with that finger there, give it another loop, and grab the hold in my hand. What I've done there, it's actually formed a nice tight bit of braid that I can now stick my mono through and start to do the twist. So put the mono underneath, a bit of tension on the bottom, and I literally go under, over, from left to right like that. And I grab that with my little finger, and I literally am just working this up the whole time, just keeping as much pressure as I can. And as I go, I'm just locking that off each time, almost like when I'm plaiting. Just lock it off. I normally go about 18 times, I just go under, over, under, over, under, over. Sometimes I just do it by eye, I don't even worry about counting to 18, I just measure about an inch or better. I just know now how many times after all the years I've been tying this knot, what it needs to look like. And when I get to the point there, I'm pretty happy. I literally just grab that, I can untwist all my braid, and I now have a tag and my actual line there that goes to my fishing reel. So this is a tricky bit, it's all about preparing. What I'm gonna do, I'm actually gonna wrap the braid around my foot to keep it nice and tight. So it's time for my half hitches. What I've actually done, I've wrapped the braid around that foot and I've got the mono going this side. For some reason with knots, it just feels more comfortable one way or the other. Do what's most comfortable for you. Now what I'm gonna do is grab this tag in my teeth and give it a good pull and just make sure that knot is locked down. It's all about keeping it tight. So here's my tag and it's simply a matter of doing a half hitch. So I just literally go over the braid and the mono and pull it through. Pull it up and pull it nice and tight using that braid wrapped around my foot to pull it up nice and tight. Now that one went over, so I now like to go under. So this is under and I'll say that's under two, under and through at the half hitch and pull that up. Over, again, lock it off nice and tight. Now under, over, under, That knot is sitting there nicely. Now the reason I go over, under, over, under, it actually creates a straight line in your half inch knots. If you go under the whole way or over the whole way, it actually forms a bit of a twist. And I just don't like the way it goes to the guide. So now I've done that, simply a matter of, I can actually cut this tag down just a little bit, this here, just to make it easier for myself. And now I just want to get this and I just want to run it on that bit of line there. So again, I go under, pull it up, Nice and tight, over. And what I don't want to do here, I don't want to pull this down too aggressively. I just want to pull it down nice and slow and pull it into there and then pull it up that last bit when I really lock it off. Then over is three, under is four, over is five. And then for the last one, what I do, I actually do a double. I go under, and I go one, two, that locks it off. So what I do, I pull this up nice and neat, and I actually keep that all untwisted and tangled till I get to the business end, and that then pulls up beautifully, and I give that a really good pull to lock it all together. Flick all that off my feet, and there we have the basis of the FG knot. All we have to do is cut our tag. So our braid, we can cut that nice and close, literally right on the knot. And with our mono, I'll just go to pull first to make sure she's locked up tight. Yep, she is. With the mono, just cut that tag nice and close, about a millimetre, bang. And there you have what I believe to be the best braid to mono leader joining knot in the world. 100% knot strength. If you're chasing mighty fish like black bass, GTs, dogtooth tuna, that is the knot you must perfect.